What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MC and you're sick and tired of getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds, head over to my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Link in the description. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today, the time is coming near to an end, man. There is not that much time left before 2K22 drops. So if you guys are new, if you could please sub it up, comment down below, man. We're going to post some crazy content for the next couple of days. I'm going to try to at least, man. And also, if you guys are interested in sports cards, look at this Bobo autograph I just got out of 99. It's sick, bro. Um, I will be going to a card show very soon. I have a huge NBA collection. If any of you guys are interested, follow the second channel, follow TikTok, follow the Instagram. Just a very nice Bobo card I just picked up right there. Hopefully, Bobo could be the GOAT. I'm very high on him. But you guys are here to make MT. Um, so I'm going to show you a couple ways. It's end game. It's going to be hard to make MT. So if some of these methods are a little dry, it's not my fault, man. Not a lot of people are on the game. Honestly, I'm not on the game that much either. I really just play my team unlimited and rage quit. Um, I really just play my team unlimited for fun at this point. It is end game. There's not that much to do. I don't feel like it's worth grinding for the last three weeks. And we're just going to go over some MT methods that I feel like could help you. One of them is this diamond contract method. This is probably one of the better methods out there. Not only that, it has a lot of freaking, uh, it has a lot of movement. At 35k, you can make some good MT. I actually, the other day, was sniping some for 30k, selling over 35, making 2,500 clean in, honestly, minutes. Um, it was happening a lot, but since Limited did, you could, yeah, blah, I, I just lost train of thought. Um, since on Limited this weekend, there was a diamond contract cheese. Um, you could get diamond contracts from Limited, so this makes this shit more movement. Um, so there was a lot more movement this week. I would honestly just recommend trying it out. It's probably one of the better filters right now, but since it is end game, there is something else and it's dark matter cards. They're so cheap. Like they're beyond cheap. And I just think you guys should definitely try sniping this shit out. Um, first off, you do have to know pricing, but like you pretty much just, you, you should just know at this point. Uh, another filter that I recommend, I'm just going to say pretty much this video is like top snipe filters. Try Giannis Dark Matter. Just try it. You never know. Sit on it for 5-10 minutes. You never know. If you do get the Giannis, it's probably one of the most expensive cards in the game. Um, anybody loves Giannis. I think everybody likes Giannis. I think everybody respects Giannis. And I think he's probably, in my opinion, the best player in the league, man. I don't care what anybody says. He's the GOAT. Uh, I think you could also try Kareem unless the Invincible is now. Yeah, you could try Kareem. There's not a lot of radioactives out here. So, you could definitely try out Kareem. It's worth the try. That's another player that I would try. Another one is LeBron, unless he is flooded. He might be flooded. Low-key flooded, not too much. But then again, there's three other LeBrons. You just want to find the invincible LeBron. There are so many LeBrons in this game, man. It's crazy. This is like, there's like 20 LeBrons. So, uh, yeah, I'm actually surprised 2K didn't drop more content. I feel like they should have dropped a little bit more content before the game. Uh, ended maybe even some locker codes is it really that hard to drop locker codes um just to get some people some more people active for end game you know get a little more content but uh lebron is pretty cool another filter is galaxy opal chivas man this one should be bumping but then again they haven't really dropped galaxy opals in packs for a really long time now so it might be kind of dry that chris bosh i don't think is a snipe it uh it might be a little snipe you know what let's check it out nah there's no way that's a snipe it would be bought already but yeah market's kind of dry right now diamond contract might be your best bet dark matter actually might be your best bet depending on what's going on because if you think about it, some invincible cards are more or less rare than honestly some diamond cards right now so if you want you can check your collection and people are still trying to do some sets man you might have some players like this sleepy fly i bet you goes for a decent amount look at that 6300 we're gonna see if that sells in the next video some cards you have in your collection are low-key rare as hell, and you might not even know. 4900 for that card. You know what I'm saying? I'm not getting Jason Tatum. I might just be throwing up a bunch of cards, seeing if they sell. People are still going for that Tatum, man. No lie, people are really still going for that Tatum. Definitely have to try this method out. The collection cheese. There's a lot of rare cards in this game. You could honestly make a pretty decent amount of MT just going through your collection. Honestly, this final set, let's see what he's probably cheap. Wow, he's even a thousand MT. There's only one up there. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of cool. If you have any Ami idols, diamond idols, they might be. Look at that. 3K for Bingo Smith. These cards are rare. 14,900 for Dennis Rodman. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to try. If that shit sells for 14,900, I'd be shocked. 
but some of these cards are rare people do need this for jason tatum so if you want to try it out let me know if it works out i think this should work out uh that kyle corver is no good look at the older sets i forgot i got this edwards let's see this my style bully he's kind of new so he's gonna be cheap He's actually not that cheap. Let's check out the Possessed. This Dino Raja. Dino Raja's 3,000 MT. So you see what I'm saying? Some of these old cards you might have in your collection are worth a lot of MT. So definitely try this out. Um, other than that, man, that's really all we got for the video. Hopefully this helps. There's not a lot of content left, man. If you don't see me posting as much, it's because I don't really know what the hell to post at this point. But yeah, that's all we got, man. Have a good one, boys. Peace.